Welcome back, Geomasters. Today's lesson, impacts of mid-latitude cyclones. Because weather isn't just about rainbows and braes. Spoiler, these cyclones can wreck your day faster than a Joburg pothole. But they're also weirdly useful. Let's unpack this. Why care? Simple. Cyclones shape SA's economy, environment, and your weekend plans. Exam pro tip. This is a hot topic for paragraph questions and case studies. Let's get started. Let's kickstart with social impacts. Cyclones are like that. One auntie who brings drama to family gatherings. Negative impacts. Floods displace people wreck roads and shut schools. Imagine missing soccer practice because your school's a swimming pool. But hey, they refill dams. Cape Town's 2018 drought, cyclones saved the day. Quick quiz, name one positive social impact, water replenishment, note that down. Economic impacts. Cyclones hit wallets harder than petrol price hikes. Let's look at the negative impacts. Crops drown, roads collapse, farmers and taxpayers cry. On the other hand, in terms of positive impacts, winter wheat thrives and snow on the Drakensberg, tourism gold, it boosts tourism. Exam tip, always mention, both sides. In paragraphs, if not specified whether positive or negative, past paper, question, Discuss two economic impacts of mid-latitude cyclones. Easy crop loss versus tourism, noise -ism. Environmental impacts. Nature's love-hate relationship. Negative impacts. Soil erosion, the floods wash away topsoil, landslides. Farms turn into mudslides, therefore leading to a decrease in production in farms. These temperate cyclones may be also a blessing, as there are positive impacts. Floods spread nutrients like COVID-19 neem, soil fertility, boost. Next up, we will look at precautionary and management strategies, aka how to stop cyclones from turning your life into an Instagram rant. Smash subscribe, and remember, weather wisdom beats cramming. Peace out, Geomasters. Stay sharp, stay curious, and keep that umbrella closer than your phone.